Aloha and welcome to another episode in the My Hawaiian Adventure series. Today I'm standing under these magnificent Moreton Bay fig trees, which are giant, giant trees. Now, you might recognise these giant buttress roots from the Jurassic Park film, the original Jurassic Park, where they filmed eggs, dinosaur eggs hatching in amongst these massive great roots. They're really, really exciting and I love this plant because of these buttress roots. They look so impressive. They grow in tropical climates, so we can't grow them back in the UK and we wouldn't really have the space to grow them because these are only about 60 years old, but they are huge. The buttress roots form on these because they grow in tropical regions, subtropical regions or volcanic regions, which Kauai and Hawaii Islands are. And because of this reason, there is a very thin layer of soil. There's not a large area for these trees to get their roots down into to support them. So what they do is they modify these roots so that they come out along the surface of the soil as opposed to going down into the earth. Now, the largest buttress roots are always on the side of the tree where the wind hits it most or it's at its weakest. So for these, it's definitely on this side. So the wind will come across from this way and that's why the largest roots are on this side, providing that structural support to the trees to ensure that they're not going to topple over. Now, these trees, as I said, are only about 60 years old, but they're going to be, they're, they're about 100 feet tall, more than 100 feet tall. So they're really, really fast growing. Now, they are part of the fig family, and as such, are only pollinated by one insect. The fig wasp is a species that only pollinates and reproduces inside the flower of their host fig. So each fig wasp has a different fig that they go and pollinate in. These trees currently are, are perfectly fine and are being propagated, which is great news. However, some fig wasp species have died out recently, which then also means you cannot propagate fig trees. So species are becoming much rarer within the fig family. Because they've got this fig wasp that's specific to them, that's why these fig trees are starting to have a few problems in terms of keeping populations up. Because if the fig wasp dies out, they can't pollinate the tree, the tree can't set seed properly. The reason why I love this tree so much is really just the buttress roots. There is really nothing quite like it. And stepping into these buttress roots and seeing like the sheer size and scale of the trees that they're supporting, it really is fascinating. That's why I love the Morton Bay fig, these trees here, so much. They really, really are stunning plants and have an unusual history as well as a media history too. As always, thank you very much for tuning in. Hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on any of my future videos. There's some really exciting stuff coming up, so do hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out. Like the video, post any comments, questions, queries in the box below and I'll be happy to answer them. Mahalo for watching and I'll see you next time.